love to, to love children. All I'm saying, all we're going to be saying in all of this conference, is that it's actually possible to have too much of a good thing. And the uh, well can't use these methods because we're not making them available to them. I see family planning as this. It's an amazing discovery in that it is enabling people to have sex uh, uh, or orgasms without actually having babies. Now we asked uh, our photographer to get every method of family planning onto one picture and they suggested uh, that uh, they would go straight to the withdrawal method uh, uh, because you couldn't show that in a picture.
for a little uh, for a little while. Um, I should reassure you that we've been able to hear against a background of intermittent static, and if it's not an offensive comment, um, our technicians here think it wasn't a local problem that it might have emanated in the northern hemisphere. <laughs> But we've certainly been able to see all of your slides very clearly, um, and that, of course, uh, has been uh, really the high point um, of the, the lecture, the parade of very interesting and stimulating material. So let, let's try for a few minutes at least and uh, see if we can engage now uh, in a discussion, and I will, if necessary, relay the question. We have one here at the back now. Uh, what's the technology, Jenny? Have we got a microphone? Yes, we, we do, coming down. Okay, a question. In Australia, for decades, we've had various governments which have had their different kinds of immigration policies. How on earth can we persuade the governments to see that this has to be set only in the context of an overall population policy? Only then can you think about the immigration side of it. Thank you. Now, John, did you, did you hear the question? Yes. Um, I deliberately didn't touch on immigration uh, directly because I expected it to come up in the discussion. Are you hearing me? Yes. Yes. Um, my take on the immigration issue, and we have a similar problem in the UK, that uh, more people want to come. To the to our already overcrowded islands than we really can accommodate. But my take on immigration is essentially if one takes a global view, it doesn't matter where on the planet the person is, the impact they'll have on the future is going to be the same uh, whether they uh, develop say, in the original donor country or whether they move to uh, a rich country and, and uh, individually start. take the world as a whole and help people to develop their own countries uh, out of poverty and then there would not be this pressure to move to other ones. In the case of Australia, uh, on that video, you might have got a view that especially from in Australia, but you and I know, don't we? I mean, I, I, that's that is it's your other country uh, at this day and time. The, the centre of Australia is dry as dry, depending on the driest continent of all. And it's in my opinion, I guess, in the first of you there, that 21 million Australians is just about as many as you can properly care for. Okay, do we have a follow up question? Yes, two here on the, um, the left hand side. Jenny? Professor, thank you very much for your talk. It's absolutely fascinating. Um, my question, however, relates to how we can influence the public and politicians, that is to get some traction, in order to move the whole debate and the paradigm in the direction of sustainability. We haven't had a lot of success in Australia. There are still huge pressures for growth, economic growth, population growth. Um, so I, I wonder if you could advise us about some of the, the tactics that might, you feel might be appropriate. Um, and also bearing in mind that what is perhaps a little frightening is that the uh, people like um, Ehrlich and Ornstein have said that human beings might be hardwired to deal with short-term issues at the expense of long-term issues. Okay, John, do you have that one? No, no, I didn't know me at all. In fact, honestly, I, I, I do hope you're hearing me, and what's that about hearing you, but uh, I'm hoping you completely for large chunks. It may be better, tell me, honestly, you're a nice guy to allow we share platforms together. It might be better for you to answer 